Today I will show you one option using which you can generate unlimited AI images and that too absolutely completely for free. So this tool will give you options to customize your image generation. Be it how the performance will be, size of the image or the styles. Look at the number of styles available in this particular tool and it will be also completely for free. And also look at the quality of the image it can generate. So be with me in this video. I'll show you all the options you need to know to generate this type of images that too absolutely for free. If you follow my mouse currently, I'm in Google homepage. And if I just paste this particular link, then you will be getting this kind of an interface. So this application is uploaded in Google Colab, which is free to use. Here, once you will see that you may think, okay, this is a bit complex, but don't worry. I'll just give you a few steps using which you will be able to use this method. First of all, you just need to check if this particular thing is connecting or not. Once I clicked on that, now it's showing connecting and after that it will come to connected state. Now you can see it's connected and it is showing that RAM and hard drive related allocations and there is a green tick. So this is the first step. Second is you need to click on this particular button so that it will set up that environment for you. Currently there is a warning. What I'll do, I'll click on run anyway. You can check and you can take your own decision. Now let me do it. If I just click on that. Now after that you will be able to see it will start setting up the environment. So what it is doing, it is setting up the environment. It is installing required prerequisites to run a model. Also in the back end, it is using Google infrastructure which are available for free for this kind of an environment. Now it may take some time to set up. So what you can do, you can just wait for some time, let the installation get completed and then I'll show you the next step. Okay, it took nearly five minutes to set up everything. And now you can see this environment is ready and one option is there, app started successfully. Use either this link or this link to access this application. So this application name is Focus and now we can use it. Now if I click on this link, it will open in a new tab and there we'll get all the options. Okay, now this is the interface we need to work on. You just need to type your prompt here and the image will be generated. Let me do one thing. I'll paste one prompt here and I'll click on generate. And after that, I'll show you few more options. How can you customize your images? How can you add different other parameters? Everything I'll show you. But let it first generate the image. And now one thing to understand, this is a free tool and it will take some more time compared to any other tools are available commercially. But end of the day, if you want some free images, I think we can spend some more time. Now let's see how it generates. You can see the quality of the image it's generating. It will generate few more options. And once this is done, we'll download that particular image and we'll see that how it generated. It's almost done. And now you can see these are the two images it generated. If I click on any of them, I'll be able to get one option from here to download. Let me click on it. This is now getting downloaded. You can see it's a 1.2 MB PNG file. I'll open that. But before that, I'll just click on the other image and I'll also download this image. Now, if I open that image separately, you'll be able to understand the quality of these images. If I just double click on this file, you can see this is the quality of the image. And we have not mentioned anything there. We just wrote one very simple prompt. And now I'll show you how can you make some more adjustments there. So while we're talking about this image generation, one small announcement. Currently, I'm in process to record one comprehensive course on generative AI. Chat GPT, Google Gemini, Microsoft Copilot, Claude, all those tools will be covered in detail in that particular course. I have added one link in the description below. Fill that particular form to get a discount coupon once the course will be launched. Now, coming back to this image generation. So if I now minimize this image and I come back here, and this is the same prompt. I'll keep it as is, but this time I'll click on advance and then you will be able to see multiple different options here. Let me just zoom in it a bit. First of all, you will be able to fine tune your image output for speed or quality. I will click on quality because I want a quality output. That is first one. Second one is aspect ratio. Look at the options. Everything is there. So whatever you are looking for, everything you can select from here. So let me do one thing. If I select this option, maybe last one, and then the option which will blow your mind, you can generate up to 32 images also at one go from your one prompt. So none of the commercial tools are available on market which provides this kind of flexibility. So for now, let me put four so that I can show you the options and then you can generate. Next is output format. 
png jpeg or wp whatever way you want i'll go ahead with the png only now i'll show you some other options that is styles you can see number of styles are available here you can just mouse hover to understand how that output will look like if you select a specific style this level of customization is not available in mid journey also which normally cost us nearly 10 dollars per month right so if i come back and here i just select some of the styles and if i select this masterpiece also but look at these options and look at the possibilities what you can do with this particular tool now focus is very very focused to make it a very useful and also generate very very high quality images now next thing is models now there are multiple different other models are available if you are aware of how weightage works and what are the different models are available with their pros and cons you can still use and you can select some of the options from here what i'll do for now i'll go ahead with the default one now next one is advanced and there you will be able to configure sharpness of your image if i just type 10 here now let's see how it generates then another option is guidance scale now there you can see it's mentioned higher value means style is cleaner, vivider and more artistic. So again here I will also type 10. Now we are ready with all our options. If I click on generate, it will generate four images. I'll go ahead and click on generate and let's see what are the output it can generate. So let's go ahead. Now you can see it started generating the image. It will also show you the options that how the progress is going on. What I'll do, I'll pause for a bit and then I'll show you the end output. Okay, now it's generated all four images. If I click on one of them and let's see how it looks like. Again, I will download that image first and then I'll open that image. Let's see how it generated. You can see the quality of this image. All these details are very well structured and very good quality. Similar way, I'll just check other image also and you can see the similar type of quality. So this is an extraordinary tool using which you will be able to generate unlimited AI images and that too completely for free. I don't know for how long will it be available for free, but for now you can just check and you can get your images generated as soon as you can. And once you are done with your image generation, you can come back to that page where you to set up this particular environment there you can stop this particular stop button so that that environment will end because these are available using free cpu and gpu from google and this is a shared service so that once you are done you can stop these services so that someone else also will be able to utilize this feature so hopefully this video will be helpful please do like and subscribe if you got any value from this video also if you want to check other options available to generate free AI images, then check out this video to know everything about it.